PPP loan part two, revenge of the IRS. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <laughs> we see you part one, guys. Damn. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to another episode. Baby, you know how we do what we do what we do what yeah, yeah. we do. We is the Smoking Permitted Podcast, but you knew that because you clicked on the link that said the Smoking Permitted Podcast. What else you thought was going to pop up? <laughs> Nothing bill. other than me, your boy, Kato Jackson, and my partner, Bob Jacquez, in here with another episode. No, I'm talking about. Oh, man. Bob. Okay, then. That's yeah. what you need to do. Uh, Episode 129. I think so. Yep, 129. 256-788-7339. Uh, Ask the smokers at gmail.com. Email. Uh, do all the things they tell you to do in the... Push like, the button, subscribe, and comment, you got share, it. um, yeah, sure. Do the notifications, um, do the percolator. Um, yeah, it's time for it. The butterfly, uh, uh-uh, uh, that's old. Let me see. It. Oh shit. Yeah, all right. <laughs> Welcome back. Thank you for joining us. We are the smokers. This is the Smoker Permitted Podcast, and uh. Shit, oh, what's popping, man? Man, I don't know, man. I can't. T- Big shit popping. No, I'm talking about man. Hey. Oh. That white boy drug my man all across. Hey, shout out to, the, to bars. Cause I, bars over bullshit. I, we can say shit on here. Yeah. Bars uh, over yeah, bullshit. bullshit. <laughs> all, all that. Um, what's the white boy name? Bow. Uh, pacemaker. 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 It was pa- pacemaker. Oh, y'all man, better get right. somebody for pacemaker. Man, right. That wasn't right how he did that that main in there. That wasn't right. Hey, shout out to y'all, man. Shout out yeah. to us too, man. Shout out to everybody Smoking that was out there here. doing the battle, goddamn. Ain't the main. That was a that was an interesting outing. It was. It was. Um <laughs> never mind. <coughs> now nah, go ahead. No. Yeah. Cause you All know right. I be talking shit about yeah. everything. Yeah. I'm not gonna talk shit about All that right. shit, man. All right. Shout out to y'all. Um, shout out to the DJ. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, <laughs> DJs. Shout, Shout out, out to, to all the DJs. Hey, hey, the man. Number hit DJs. Um, um, yeah. Josky Love. Josky Love. Uh, all the way up DJs. Yeah. Lachey B just won. I don't. I should know. I'm sorry, I don't know. She just won some a real good award. I don't know which one it was, but it was good though. It was a good one. I know it was a good one. It was a women's award. Shout out to Lachey B for winning the award. Um, DJ Illy, DJ 808. Yeah. Shout yep. out to all y'all. Yep. That's what's up. Shout yeah. out to the, the um the old dude who be doing the funeral announcements and shit. All right, shout yeah. him out too. I ain't the main. Shout out to everybody up there. We up. Watch this. That's all right. Somebody <laughs> tell him we got shout okay. it out. He be like, huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> right. Shout it out? <laughs> yeah, the stain on him. <laughs> you can shout it out, uh, yeah. Uh, no, uh, I'm too old. Uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> How'd you man, we back in this thing, man. Um, I guess I had a um, it was warm this week. Oh man. Um, I work outside, so I ain't enjoy that a whole lot. But it is what it is. Um, it's over now. I'm chilling. Um, I'm excited. My 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 plants is producing a lot more than I expected right now. Okay. So yeah. Um, the pros and cons of the weather. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's what's up. Fuck, is, like, is it, it's cucumbers and shit like that. Is that why you have on sunglasses right now? Is that you were so hot that you just didn't take them off, or what? Nah, doing? this just um, I be doing new shit sometimes. Right. Like it's real bright. All the little lights in yeah. here, babe. Hey. Hey. extra bright. Want to yeah. try to see? Me. Yeah. Okay. That's what's up. Yeah. I'm not and mad. And then I'm smooth as fuck. Shit. Yeah. Are you gonna like get a bunch of the same pair of sunglasses? Or why are you, you gonna do start? This? I'm if just, you get more than one of the same, we I'm just asking get some what, how you do. I'm, I was going to. I don't know because I don't do really wear one. sunglasses for real, <laughs> <laughs> so I don't really know. I feel <laughs> like one should be enough. Okay, though. No. Can we? I wish we could pan to the fucking Hot Wheels collection that you've acquired since I last saw oh, you. That's that you just mentioned tonight. That you just happen to not mention at That's all. Time out though. one of something. You don't get one of something. But the glasses, I got one pair of glasses and they <laughs> broke, so I don't even fuck with them. So I ain't even get another one to get You didn't want to get those, though. No, nah, I wanted them. I could see. <laughs> <laughs> I fuck with that. I fuck with that heavy. I fuck with vision. Hey, hey, it's just wild, bro. You wouldn't even know what it's like. <laughs> for real, for real. 
Hey, all right, so just one pair of sunglasses. We're going to keep it moving. Maybe. Now you got me questioning. Now, I'm just wondering. Because I'm know. just saying, they do make different colors to shit. They do. You can just get the handle a different color. Like, it's hey, options. Hey, shit, that's what it's called, the handle? Yeah. Ooh. Well, some people call it an arm. An arm? Okay. I would have went with arm. Yeah. I would have went with arm. Yeah. Shit, shout out to sunglasses, shit. For sure. <laughs> um, I don't understand why, like, you could get a pair of $20 sunglasses, or you could get a pair of, like, Twenty thousand dollars sunglasses. They look the same, and I don't know what they do differently. I'm I'm a little confused about that since I entered the sunglass world. I mean, it's the same as everything else. It no, but on some the shit like yeah, do but yeah, but and sunglasses like what? I yeah, but like the quality. I don't understand what a different the amount of UV it blocks and how well they'll stay together for how long. Ah, oh, okay. All right. Long, longevity. That, and okay. whose name's on it. I know that make most of the difference, but I was just wondering. Like, with Polo and shit, it's, mm. it's the name, too, but it make a difference, too. Like, this mm. is good quality shit for real. Yeah, like, they I might use screws that ain't made from, like, metal shavings. Okay, then. And, and the $20 glasses might have screws that they put together in a mold from some metal shavings. Okay, then. You know what I'm saying? Right. It might be little shit like that. Right. I don't fucking know, though. Because I almost just bought some 200s, <laughs> and I was like, why, though? <laughs> I've had a couple of nice pair of sunglasses. And then I be too. losing shit, too. Yeah. Yeah, I lost, like, four grills. I don't want to buy no oh, more. Damn. Yeah, I don't want to buy no more. That's but, what I'm worried about. Once I get to start my watch collection, that's what I'm worried about is losing them hoes. See? I have insurance on. Man, all right. I should've got insurance on my grill. Yeah, you can get it on your um, sunglasses. And nigga, I paid like nine hundred dollars for this. How much can I insure it for? <laughs> you, I, you could, I could see you getting a collection of some buffs. No, I don't, I don't want no buffs. I don't want no expensive ass sunglasses. I, I could. It I can't. Surprise. Not right now. Maybe. Maybe after you. Maybe after you go from Ralph Lauren to Purple Label. I don't want the Purple Label. I be looking at this shit and I don't One day like you it. Might, uh, what's no. after? It's Black Label after that, right? I don't know. I ain't looked that far. See, I'm, I'm telling you. <laughs> but I'm saying, I think I'm comfortable the, right now. Yeah. I think no matter what you I get. You thought you was comfortable before. No, I, I knew I wasn't. <laughs> I knew I wasn't. <laughs> you can't count the Amazon clothes. You can't I, count that. I knew that. I wasn't, though. <laughs> the jerseys and the Nike and the shit, I knew I wasn't. Like, I ain't playing no ball. <laughs> You ain't golfing. Well, I got on the Nike Tech suit. I will. You, <laughs> I will. Uh, you golf before you play some ball. Okay. Next. That's After the high wheels, <laughs> Tiger Woods out this bitch. Poor Tiger Woods. That motherfucker like number 83rd or something shit right there. Stop. Just stop. Tiger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck yeah. it. He probably still get a little 15000 or something. He might have joined on the Wizards now. He worse. He worse. He worse. <laughs> he is. <laughs> <laughs> But shout out Tiger, though. Shout out Tiger Woods, <laughs> though. <Josh. laughs> hey, beat your ass. <laughs> Man. I see the interview Man. that nigga said, no, nah, see, I ain't hurt right now, but I could be hurt. <laughs> so either I could practice a lot and be good and risk getting hurt, or well, I could come out here and not game. be good and, and not be hurt. <laughs> I bet you just said it's your practice. Like, I mean, I'm what old you doing now. here, right? Like, what else do you. <laughs> you should be yeah, home watching this shit now. He should. Fuck Four you, time. K. You got to practice, goddammit. Man. Nigga, just show up. I ain't, practice. You practice when you get hurt. Get practice. Hurt practice. My kids, you want me to do? Daughter, can I hang on your arm? She don't understand. No, because I need this for work tomorrow. Man, okay. Pull this shit all out of place. Man, what? I ain't going to be able to use it. No, I got to pull it out of the place at work. No. <laughs> It's just straight, you got to stretch first. Yeah, I don't do that. I should. Me neither. Yeah, I ain't uh, I ain't have an event for a week as you, uh, you know, work. I had some short days, though. I was getting through my days. Man, what? Did got out that house, move? got back, goddamn. Um, I did promise my kids I'd take them to go spend some money that they've been saving, sitting around the house, a little bit of money. Okay, then. All so right. I took them. <coughs> really didn't fucking want to. Man, hey, didn't want to go nowhere. I told them, so we went. Go spin that bag. Uh, they got toys, and we went back and played with them. And so I ended up fighting my son and daughter with with six different weapons for okay. two days straight. All right, then. It's like a little battle roar around that bitch. Yeah. All right. What's up? Yeah. It was fun. Like, the first 17 seconds, yeah, and I get that pow, 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 damn. pow, pow, I'm up. It was over. And then after that, I'll be like, Man, I ain't got a damn. <laughs> Y'all want to fight all day? 
Like you lost already. You already lost. Man, what? Like that was your head. I chopped it off. Shit over with. You probably be dead for at least <laughs> at least an hour. Hey. <laughs> hey. Yeah, I gotta get my life together. I can't sort it fight for five minutes. Man, all right. Tell the niggas about some power wheels so I can beat his ass in power wheels. Not power wheels, high wheels. High wheels. Yeah, because I show I think we gave all them cars and shit away. Man, like not I, too long ago. Yeah, only, I'm only buying smooth shit though. All right. The Hot Wheels. You know how I do shit. Thing. If I yeah, start I some shit, I'm going to go way overboard with this shit. I know. It's going to be Hot Wheels all be over Hot this Wheels bitch. Hot Wheels video coming to y'all soon. Real soon. From Reverend Jackson and the Smoking Permitted Podcast. Already. Um, Pick a car. Any car. We're giving out congratulations. Right? I ain't a man. I ain't a man. Congratulations to, is it Fawn? Fawn. Fawn. Yeah, like a baby deer. Like a baby deer. Mm -hmm. Fawn Weaver. On at Uncle Nearest, that's what I'm finna fuck it up. Uncle Nearest, it's some whiskey. Yeah. yeah. So yeah, the story yeah. behind this, I don't know if y'all know. Tell them what it is. Jack Daniels. Everybody know Jack Daniels. He learned how to make whiskey from a slave. He ain't getting none of the credit because nigga, you a slave. So then the slave started making his own shit on the low. Yep. Bow. Uncle Nearest. Wow. So this the nigga who taught America how to make whiskey for real, for real. On God and them. And um, Fawn run the company now. Fawn. Fawn, Fawn. Fawn. I don't, all right, no, then, shit. Fawn's the device we talk on. Fawn. <clears throat> now, I ain't say phone. You did. I said Fawn. <clears throat> Fawn. See, that's not phone. It's Fawn. <laughs> it's, it, I'm just saying. That's a different it's word right camera. now. It's on camera. Um, I don't got to say that. So Uncle Nearest <laughs> has to pass. One billion dollars in the company worth, <coughs> and has become the fastest growing American whiskey brand. A whiskey brand. I can't talk right now, but yeah, Uncle Nearest is shitting on all the other whiskeys. No, I'm talking about. And it just, it's, it's a good, it's a cool full circle for it to be a recipe that was made by a black person back when we couldn't do shit or have shit. shit. And at this point, it's the fastest growing company being ran. By a black person. Finna overtake so, Jack Daniels out this bitch. Yeah, so. But you thought it was. That shit's fire. For real, for real. And this shit's strong. Yeah. This shit's it's good whiskey. strong. It's good whiskey. Oh, man. Go get you some Uncle Nier. Shit. Um, Shout out the phone. <laughs> <laughs> Stop playing with me. <laughs> hey. Uh, Any more shout outs? Who else? Um. Shout out to all OJ Simpson kids. And Brian McKnight's. And Brian, both of them. Both sets. <laughs> both, sets. both sets. We don't play their favorite shit over here. Shout out to both sets of Brian McKnight's kids. Um, shout out to everybody who, who watching us on that fire stick. Yep, shout um, out y'all. I ain't know. Okay. Yeah, you get YouTube on there. That's you what's you up. know, go watch us on your fire stick. Um, shout out. Um... To everybody who was supposed to come and didn't, and I didn't was just come. thinking about that. Damn! <laughs> Shout them out. Shout out to y'all. The list is long. I ain't gonna say y'all name. Smoke some bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I agree. Um, um, Shout out to all our old co-hosts. Yeah. Um, all the friends of the show. I ain't a man. Uh, who else we shout out? Um, shout out to everybody with a zebra. That's, that's what's up. Shout out to y'all. And everybody with a peacock. And it, shit, if you got a peacock and you, you plan on breeding it or something, like <laughs> I'll buy some eggs or something. Like I want a peacock. Like, yeah. You going to incubate the peacock? Yeah, all that shit. All that shit. <laughs> yeah. Or maybe just wait till they hatch and let yeah. me get the baby peacocks. Yeah. Maybe do that. Maybe do that <laughs> instead. Baby. Let me get the peacock chicks. Yeah. Or let me just buy the mama shit. <laughs> Fuck it. That bitch for sale. <laughs> Man, <what? laughs> That bitch pretty over there. <laughs> All them colors in their little feathers. <laughs> How much you want for that little bit? That's what fucked up. The bitches don't be the, pretty, the, the colorful ones, the dudes. No. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> Tell me the little nigga. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Damn, I became a slave on her real quick. <laughs> Damn. Ooh. <laughs> Shout out to Peacocks, hell. Hell yeah. yeah. Oh, what we man. got going on? Tell me about this shit right here. So, apparently there's an STI <coughs> ringworm now? Well, 
from the way it read to me, there's been one. Oh, it's been here. It's been one. Oh. And this is just the first case in the United States. Ah, oh, okay. So it's some, some other shit. Yeah. But now so, we got it. So for anyone who, you know, just out here running these streets the way some of y'all do, the first case of rare sexually transmitted form of ringworm mm. has been reported in the U.S. That's some cold shit right there. That's some cold shit. If y'all out here giving motherfuckers ringworm, stop that shit. It's stop in New York. Shit. Is where they uh is where they did the test of shit. Damn. But um, I guess you're gonna see. They said in France there was 13 cases last year. Oh, so it's it's oh it's, damn, it's, it's popping up now. Well, 12 of those patients were men who have sex with men. Oh, this is the new age. It's a gay ringworm. It's a gay ringworm. Man, <laughs> okay. A, but then it was one that wasn't. But he was probably over there. Yeah, and he, he was came. on the down low. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She ain't know. Man, okay. He was fucking broke. Damn. But now <laughs> she got it, and she finna go goddamn. Give it to another dude. See? So I'm, it's, it's but a, she got a record of fucking down low dudes now. So she probably. She might not, can't get it. Man. Uh, um, hey, if you got this shit, y'all need to sit the fuck down somewhere. Do. <laughs> At the doctor's office. <laughs> At a hospital. Man, okay. That's where. At a hospital. That's where. Emergency <laughs> room. Right there. <laughs> what you in here for, bitch? I got ring <laughs> With a diaper roll. Man, what? Hey, hey. You on the inside and outside. Hey, outside. <laughs> Two of the bitches. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh, man. That's wild. Man, I didn't know ringworm could come out of Pussy penis. Pussy ringworm. That's, that's scary. That's scary. That is that's a horrifying scary. news. Hey, what these other countries be fucking going through, man? Everything. Could you imagine? <laughs> what? It's new for us, but somewhere this shit been happening, yeah, God damn it. Man, all right. And they been known about it. Ain't nobody say nothing. Because we ain't need to know it. Ain't been over here. Don't tell me about it if it I ain't got to worry about it. It did say it. a rare. Yeah. Sexually transmitted. If form. I don't need to worry about it, don't tell me about it because I'm worried about it. <laughs> yeah. That's why I'd be like, damn. Why would why would you put that on? All right. Well, yeah. So y'all be careful, man. Hey, wrap it up. Um, cause bitches is out here giving motherfuckers ring yeah. now. Tell all your gay friends. Man, tell them the news. Hey, save right. a life. All right. they, or they, they, crotch. Right, I don't really know how far they this goes. They didn't pretty much. They they. I ain't gonna say they getting rid of AIDS, but it ain't like it used to be now. Mm -mm. So yeah, they, they gotta, gotta they gotta hit them with something new, goddamn yeah, it. Yeah. All right, all right. That's fucked up. During Pride Month, y'all gonna give the gay folks a disease. That's fucked up. This what they was waiting on. <laughs> this what they, you know how the government will do you, goddamn it. That's true. She. That's true. Them bitches sent me a letter in the mail this month. Said next month you need to pay us this much, God damn. <laughs> Ain't no 30 days, six months, no none of that shit, right. nigga. This letter say next month. In a fortnight. And you just got it, guy. <laughs> all right, all right. They don't give a fuck. They don't give a fuck. <coughs> Man. Man. It's fucked up, government. It's fucked up, government. The government on something, else? What you got? What you talking about on there? What the government doing? What Florida doing? What Florida doing? You told me the housekeepers in, in Florida was balling on these bitches. Yeah. You said they was making more than doctors. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Finna fucking move to Florida and clean hotel rooms. I'm a goddamn man. Like, no, I think imagine? like people that was like going and cleaning people houses. Houses, man. I I bet. So it's a bunch of posts on, on Instagram at least talking about how housekeepers are making the same amount as as doctors in Florida, which is fucking crazy because there's a due to the shortage of housekeepers oh so they can tax for real yeah. and florida got a lot of rich people too hundred and fifty thousand a year shit all right smoking permitted house cleaning <laughs> coming to florida so <laughs> we smoking in your house though bitch hey man why are we clean we smoking that's our, we that's clean. our take yeah. we smoking in your house though bitch <laughs> Shit. Do you are you cleaning mansions for one hundred fifty thousand a year? I yeah. It I don't know. The, <laughs> I'm saying it depends on how many mansions a day we clean it. Like shit, you can make one hundred fifty thousand doing most shit if you really to work your motherfucking ass off for real. So if that's what we doing, like it ain't really no no advantage to this shit for real for real. 
Yeah, I don't really know what housekeeping in Florida entails. What you got to do in the mansion, really. Like, you got to clean the, the fucking the floorboards. Or yeah, what you, what I'm, you call I'd them, imagine, the baseboards. The baseboards, I'd imagine so shit. <coughs> I'd imagine you got to clean this. This bitch got to look new. You got to detail you gotta, like, this bitch. Dust the chandelier. All this shit. Thirty feet up in shit, the air. You better bring a ladder, guy. <laughs> <laughs> you, you make know, more hey, than a doctor. Like, I, don't God really damn know. It. I don't really know. What... If my housekeeper make more than a doctor, I'm expecting not to ever see no kind of dirt in my motherfucking house. Maybe them doctors need to charge them. No, I'm just <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's because of the inflation shit. That's how the doctor prices ain't went up yet, God damn it. Uh, maybe they need to see more people a day. Man, all right. Who fault is that? Run these motherfuckers out of here. <laughs> shit, I don't know if they can, though. I went I to know. the doctor. I was out there bitch in about 30 minutes, God damn it. After I said it, it in the lobby for do. like an hour. It, yeah, I don't say it. Depending <laughs> on what you're going to do. They just need to ring. They just need to ring that bill up. That's all. Good, all right. But yeah, if if because I'm imagining I'm contributing a good part of this doctor salary that these motherfuckers making for cleaning up my mansion. So yeah, I don't want to see no dirt. I feel like hotel room type clean, like good five star hotel room every time. Like I could goddamn leave my my shirt on the floor. And when I come back, my shirt is not on the floor. No. Like you come back out the bathroom, the shirt's not, picked not, up. Not that fast. Like, this what you doing right here. <laughs> I'm saying, like, but I'm just saying, you... like, today this going to get picked up, goddamn. Hmm. So it's a live-in position. Maybe so, shit. Yeah, I'd imagine so. Yeah, you, you got a mansion. You got your little maid's quarters You live in some old man's house? And like, oh, me? Like, yeah, no, nah, I don't live there. I don't live there. <laughs> I don't live there. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm. I, Wasn't that Alfred? I, it's different. Yeah. I'm not. I guess if I'm gonna clean up your house, I'm I'm pulling up to clean up your house. Uh, yeah. You got a room down there under yeah, the nah, stairs. Yeah, see, I don't do that. One. Gotta, I don't do that. I don't do that. One. I gotta go home. You got room under the stairs. Yeah, but I gotta go home. Wash your hands. Your shirt end up on this floor after I've cleaned this part. Like it'll be here till when I come back. <laughs> Yeah, nah, fuck that. Oh, that's a tomorrow shirt. <laughs> Man, what? <laughs> nah, it's smooth, though. It's still, yeah, it's straight. <laughs> I get that beat to it. What? Oh, the hair thing. I ain't going to forget. <laughs> I got to come back through here. Oh, boy. Shit. Yeah, nah, I can't live over there. Yeah. I don't know. So, yeah. yeah, save save yourself. Stop having all this wild sex. Go to Florida, clean some mansions. Clean some mansions. We giving you all the jewels. We be having our little wild sex. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna pick up thirty seven cars. They must be talking about Diddy's housekeeper. Man, okay. <laughs> Could you imagine? They got to make more than that. Fuck right. that. You got to keep secrets. Shit, all right. Diddy housekeepers got to keep secrets. Um, this your favorite athlete, I think. What you know what? She is. I think it is. It might be. For real, for <laughs> real. She is. I don't even like Ratchet, goddammit. I don't even see it. It might be for real. I think it is. Um, what she get? What she get? How much she get? What the sound effects Shikari Richardson has just landed a $20 million deal. Congratulations. With Nike. Good. With Nike. Gracious. Watch out, little bitch. So, hey, yeah. Hey, New running shoes on the way. Wow. Go buy oh, you some. get you such a car? Shit, if they make a 14. All right, <laughs> If they make a 14, I'm going to give me some. Yeah. I will be. You're going to have to put it in a song. If you got if you can push cars on, you got to write a bar about it. Oh, okay, then. I might yeah. have to do that. I'm God and them. I ain't in my... Who are them, though? You know. I can't put it on them if I don't know them. On the ones that be with God. We talked about this already. The, the, the 12 of them. Yeah, well, some of them. Man, some of them came right. later. Yeah, folks man, just don't know. One of those was on some bullshit. <laughs> yeah. That too. Man, okay, Ooh, get nah. it. I, seen, I seen this dude go on Joe Rogan trip me the fuck out. No. He was talking about uh, he's a linguist. I don't know. That's a not linguist? the name. That's not the title that it's supposed to be. Is that like a language? Yeah, like he be, he know Greek and shit. And he go back and read all this ancient Greek text of the Bible. And okay. he be talking about what Jesus is really doing. When they found them and shit, no, it was crazy. No. Oh boy, it was wow, wow. I'm talking Man, about okay. no ditty. No, oh, damn. Oh, who the text? Damn, said, Jesus. Damn. <laughs> damn. Hey, my baby will get high. 
playing with little kids. Oh, God. Man, I, everybody in the Bible had to be high, though. Like, for real. <laughs> you think about this shit. There's a lot of them people was on drugs. Yeah. A nigga sat down next to a bush. The yeah. bush caught on fire. Mm-hmm. Now he's talking to him. Mm-hmm. And nigga, didn't you, go out. You high, nigga. That's <laughs> yeah. weed in that bush. <laughs> Nah, they was on some shrooms. And it was something in that bush. They had some. A motherfucker bit they the apple. The first room. A bit of apple. Yeah. And the whole way, the whole awakening of mm-hmm. everything. Nigga, it's drugs. And now, because they didn't even say it was apple. Like they just the said a fruit. It was drugs. It could have been one of them big ass mushrooms going <laughs> to the pine <laughs> okay. trees. Bitch, high as fuck. It was drugs in there. Man. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah, that shit was The motherfucker wild. was running and looked behind them. And turned to stone. Everything. You on drugs. Yeah, yeah. You see you people on heroin. Yeah, <laughs> right. You know what the lead is. They just stop you right know there. What the lead is. Shit. What's it now? <laughs> <laughs> Shit, all right. All right. I'm just saying. <coughs> people be mad at you when you say the obvious shit. But yeah, man. Don't be mad at me. Just look yeah. at what you see. That's all you got to do. Shout out, Shakar. Congratulations. Hey, man, 20 million. To go from, I mean... I seen her with no, she ain't had no color hair on or nothing <coughs> in the picture they showed. I'm saying though, are you are you giving up the metal chance for the 20 mil? Why would she have to do that? Well, I'm, because that's the road that she ended up taking. You know, she missed out on the chance to get a medal. Yeah. And but she ended up at this point. Yeah. And yeah. she just I guess, but if I had to choose. Men. Would you would you go back if you had an option? If you I go had back to and be like, nah, man. I'm gonna go for the medal. Yeah, nah, fuck that. How much yeah. the medal worth? Yeah, nah. Fuck <laughs> How much the medal worth? What was that? Four years ago? <laughs> okay. Four years to get twenty I mil? Mean. Y'all gonna talk about me a couple times and I'm gonna go win some races? That's it. I gonna... still get my hair done. Man, nah. I, I, yeah, nah, oh shit, I got one too. Man. <laughs> yeah, nah, twenty mil. Air time. Air time. Yeah. You fuck about yeah. that medal? Yeah, she, I hate to say that because like that's that's important for. I mean, it is, to, but you know, that's important too. I wonder yeah. how she feels like she really twenty million important too. She really like, and the medal come back. It'll come back around. She got other medals, just not in Olympic. Yeah, but I'm saying though, she had to wait about four years, ain't it? Yeah. four years. She she probably could do another past this one. She probably could do another one or two Olympics at least if she wanted yeah, to. Yeah, she'll get a little medal. She look how I do the medal. <laughs> you get that little medal. She get a little medal. That little medal. Man, what? Go get my little medal. You already got the twenty million. Go get your little medal anybody. now. He ain't missing nothing but the little medal. That she. <laughs> you don't want to get the medal? Smoke some more weed. Right. Hey, look at my so many color hair on that guy. <laughs> Every strand a different color. Man, okay, six nine. Man. Yeah, yeah. That's what's up. That's what's up. You can't be you can't be Chicago and get twenty mil, but you can still move to Florida. Hey, one fifty a year. You save it up, shit, and then wash some walls. You find some shit that wasn't supposed to be found, <laughs> shit. In Miami, not Florida, that yeah. 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 Just saying. You can blackmail somebody if well, you find I the right never, information. I was thinking like, she, oh, you oh. Know. They got some dope in here somewhere. Yeah, that too. That too. That too. That could be part of the black man. I, I, I ain't even black man. I don't work at no boss. Yeah. <laughs> he left. <laughs> With a bag at, I don't know. <laughs> you can do all that. Yeah. Motherfucker be fine. This shit just you be floating up on the You take it with you after you take the blackmail pictures. You I guess you right. could do that too, <laughs> goddamn. You could do that too. Weird, weird shit. Yeah. Getting all the money. Hey, now you Might got make shit. him buy it back here. Hey. <laughs> hey. Uh-uh, I don't trust it. All right, I don't trust it. The police we can get out of there. there. I'm going down the wrong. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I'm saying somebody, the police gonna be there. It's gonna be a shootout. Right. It ain't gonna work uh-huh. like that. Speaking of shootouts, they still beefing. Who beefing? The North and the South. The North and the South. <laughs> Korea's still at it. Um, I talked about the trash bags that were sending back and forth, yeah, yeah, and the the, the uh, what did they call them? I called them pamphlets, but that's not what they were saying. Paraphernalia, maybe? Literature or something. Literature? I forget what it was, but it was something that made it sound like it was a little pamphlet that you okay, put. Then. But uh, North Korea and South Korea don't fuck with each other, so one of them's at the border passing shit back and forth. The other one, like, we're going to throw trash bags on you, and we're going to blow some balloons and let the balloons carry the trash over there to you and drop it over there where y'all live because we don't fuck with y'all. Trash so bomb, then, bitch. They tried to send some back. No, nah, they was like, well, stop if you stop giving... The people that live on this side of the imaginary line, these papers that say stuff that we don't want them to read. And then they was like, we're not going to do that. So they kept sending 
trash. So then they finally, before this, they was all supposed to be having a treaty. They had been Everybody's working on it for be a cool. long time. Yeah, yeah. And this just sent it all overboard. So then they was like, all right, fuck it. We're going to calm down for a little second. But then uh, the folks that had the little leaflets, that's what they were calling them. The leaflets. leaflets. Okay, then. The folks that were handing out the leaflets was like, you know what? Fuck that. We got this speaker wall we used to use to blast annoying ass loud sounds that way to okay. them folk. And we're going to turn this bitch back on because they, they had the nerve to send trash balloons. Yeah. So then they turned the fucking wall back on. And then the other niggas was like, oh, bitch. Y'all wouldn't be loud. That's what we're doing. We're going to send some more trash balloons. Okay, then. So, North Korea, <laughs> South Korea, being petty as fuck right now. Like, what the fuck's happening right now? What? You're a grown what the ass fuck is happening? adult. Yeah. They live on their own balloons? island. They their own country. Nigga, turn ACDC on these bitches. <laughs> turn it up real loud. What? We're going to keep giving them papers. Man, what the fuck is going on? What? They really gonna like kill each other over this shit though. Why? That's like, what I'm saying. But like shooting missiles in a little bit. That's what's finna happen. Absolutely, <laughs> like, absolutely. Over. Somebody gonna throw some, put a balloon full of rocks no. over in that bitch, and then that's gonna right. escalate to something else. <laughs> and in a minute, the bitch gonna have a balloon with a bomb in it. God how did somebody decide? How who? When was you sitting there? And you was like, <laughs> you know what? I bet this balloon could carry that trash bag. Send that bitch over there. <laughs> Send it that new pussy ass nigga. You gotta, you gotta, <laughs> Send it to the pussy ass niggas out of north. Well, only giving you papers. Stop sending this trash. Bitch, <laughs> send some more papers, bitch. Send some more papers. Fuck them leaflets, ho. Take this garbage. Man. Fuck out of here. And they can, you know they petty because they kept the sound wall from a long time ago. They've been, they been having this bitch waiting. They been the there. It's look a, like the old speaker. They look like the, the weather, the sirens. Man, okay. That's what the little speaker look <laughs> like. Got some horns. <laughs> it's inspecting this, inspect this shit every three months to make sure it still work. Guys. Just in case <laughs> these motherfuckers want some Man, shit. What? God damn, nigga. Sure what? How loud this bitch is? Like, how fuck could it go for real? I guess it's close enough to the border. But like. In the whole country, <laughs> this bitch. I think so. The niggas in the South ain't got to worry about this shit. I mean, it's pointed away from them. No, I'm like, I was the South pointed at the North. Oh, let me see who got the speaker wall. <laughs> okay. That sounds like some North shit for real. I feel like Kim Young Yoon got the goddamn speaker wall in the trash in the South sitting in pamphlets. Like, hey, we could free you. Right. <laughs> I think so. I think it was the North that was with the dumb shit. Yeah, yeah. Are you going to free who, bitch? (laughs) You better quit telling them they're going to be free. Okay. Sure, these motherfuckers, the grocery stores really look like. (laughs) Fuck out of here with this shit. Yeah, no, fuck this shit. Oh, South Korea got the speakers. South Korea got the speakers? Yeah, because yeah, North I ain't, Korea was sending the trash. I ain't, they even the mad at, on, I ain't even mad at the speakers no more. I ain't even mad at the speakers. Because I know South don't like even be on that bullshit yeah. for real. They, they had to turn that old shit back on. Man, okay. <laughs> I ain't even mad at them. First, I was like, that's some bullshit. Now, nah, fuck that. Because I know the South don't be on that bullshit. The North yeah. be on that bullshit. So I was trying to give out them, papers, them freedom papers. And then, you know, started to <laughs> the trash. And then got there in the South. was like, all right, that's enough fucking trash and doodle. Because it wasn't just trash. Like, if you read the first report, they said oh, yeah. there was like feces and stuff in the bag and stuff, too. So they, they got sick of it, turned shit. on their speakers. And they was like, oh, I bet. We're going to send more trash. So that's what's going on on the other side of the world right now. Some petty ass shit. You know what I'm saying? Some petty ass shit. It's helped me out when I be like mad at somebody. Man, okay. <laughs> <laughs> at least it ain't goddamn yeah. balloons or trash you know floating over your worse. house. Man. It could be okay. fucking worse. Man, there. Please don't land over here. Please Jeez, don't it. land. It could be worse. I'd be mad when someone pull up to pick somebody up that live by me and honk the horn. No. Bitch, call them and text them. Don't pull up in front of someone's door honking the horn. Yeah, okay. I don't fucking know you out. No. I'd be mad about one horn honk. I don't know what I'm going to do with the sound one. That's fair. You be mad about a lot of shit. <laughs> you be mad, goddamn it. Who the fuck out here blowing the, the horn, man? I'm right in in my door. It's three, four doors for this day, though. Goddamn, okay. fuck you over here blowing the horn for? Goddamn. Yeah, text them, motherfucker. You're going to be on your front lawn. <laughs> now get out of my goddamn grass. I am. 
So is. Your ball going Bob Yard, that bitch gone. Yeah. It's mine now. <laughs> oh, shit. It's going to be like the Sandlot. I'm man, okay. Yeah. There. Yeah, your ball go back there. It's over yeah. with. God damn it. Yeah. It's fucked up, Bob. Yeah, I couldn't deal with a sound wall. I don't know what I'd do. Man, I, what? Imagine oh my God. They, they bitch oh. close to your house. <laughs> oh, too, my God. God damn it. Man, but what? You just got to work. You just go to work on the border. Yeah. You, that's your job. You got to be over there. Man. I might last. I ain't going to last a whole day. For real. I might last a couple of hours before I just. That's that bullshit. Nuts in that bitch. Koreas. Koreas. Get play, it together, Koreas. That's all you like, though. <laughs> <laughs> What fuck me and that bitch jam? So turn I type a text up, to this girl I used to man, see. Okay. <laughs> I kill him, John. Turn uh, that shit up, man. <laughs> Stop playing. I'm you saying, wouldn't play the whole song. Somebody got to like whatever they play. If they play a music on that No, I think it's just set like sounds. Oh, it's just yeah. sounds. Yeah, it's just like irritating a, a shit. war tactic yeah, shit. It's, yeah, yeah. I remember they present. used to torture motherfuckers. They like... In Abu Dhabi or whatever. Yeah, they just play music loud as hell yeah. all the time. Yeah. They might have they might got some grunge rock. I know playing. they playing out okay, that's on that bitch. <laughs> Kim Jong. Hey. Bombs I'm over saying, Baghdad. Hey man, okay. <laughs> over and over again. Oh repeat, God damn it. Oh shit, nigga in the Nago. Oh, know what the fuck it's saying? <laughs> I don't know neither, goddamn oh, right. shit. Oh, man, I, I almost did something racist. Man, stop. No, don't man, do man, it. I didn't. Don't do it. Not gonna do don't it. Do oh, it. It. speaking of racist, <laughs> well, I thought the no offense said, "Oh, oh." Um, so the Tulsa, Oklahoma, fires, burnings, the, uh, bombings, and shit. Yeah, yeah. what, what is it? Let me find the correct. Was it Black Wall Street? Let me see which one it was. I think this shit was Black Wall see. Street. Motherfuckers bump like The Ever. Tulsa Race Massacre. Okay, then. All right. Is what I'm referring to. There were three uh, remaining survivors from that massacre, and they had tried to file a lawsuit um, in Oklahoma to get some type of reparations for the pain and suffering and loss. Some goddamn shit. And recently, Oklahoma Supreme Court dismissed the lawsuit. So nigga, they will what? not get anything. Give you some money because they didn't kill you, and they, nigga. And they all, like, you couldn't get a whole boat. You couldn't get them off a little bit. Of right, right. <laughs> they ain't they need no hundred million, goddamn it. Give them up. Man, nah, man. Come on, you man. a whole Oklahoma. Yeah. You could have gave that lady a motherfucking new Buick or something. She don't Shit. got 10 left. Hey, she could have had a nice a, little, a Buick yeah, and, and a driver. 400,000 and a driver. I ain't a man. Shit. You out here bullshit in Oklahoma? Yeah, yeah I, I'm a little upset about that, Oklahoma. So not shout out Oklahoma. Yeah, shout no. out all the other states Fuck except Oklahoma. Oklahoma. I ain't in my ain't. Where my sound effects? I mean the other people in Oklahoma, but the government? Yeah, yeah. no. There's a nigga in Oklahoma watching like, no, nah, fuck y'all, nigga. Right. <laughs> oh, yeah? Oh, yeah, fuck <laughs> us, huh? Okay. Oh, oh, I'll see about that. <laughs> shout out to the people, but hey. Fucking Oklahoma boo. That's what I wanted. I wanted to boo Oklahoma. Bitches, Oklahoma State Supreme Court. Whoever the fuck was in court that day, folk was, made Everybody that decision. Everybody in that bitch. The, no, That's the so bailiff wrong. too. Fuck yeah. all yeah, the yeah, niggas. Them too. If it was a jury, if, fuck If my all man the who judges. jumped over the at the judge would have hit you, fuck you. All right. All right. <laughs> Fuck who was ever at the door, the nigga who walked through that bitch like y'all gotta turn y'all phones off in here. Fuck that nigga, Fuck goddamn. That nigga. Fuck the Fuck attorneys that was in the bitch. parking, driving Fuck around the, the lot. The nigga at the metal detector. Fuck that nigga, goddamn it. Fuck all them. The, nigga, won't get the trustee money. who had watched the police car that came to court that day. Nigga, fuck the, you uh, too, goddamn. Fucking damn. stenographer. Fuck that bitch. Write fucking that shit whore. out. Ta- type that shit. You don't even need little letters. <laughs> <laughs> I got to say it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I got to say it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Get upset. I got upset for you. Hold Wait, on. Okay. Are you ready? What we doing? Here we go. Oh, all right. I got 200 right now. If that hoe can show me, nigga, nigga, all my kids, nigga, my daughter, two years old, can count to 30, nigga. Fuck you, me, hoe. That's what's I got up. 200 for anybody that can get that hoe on here and say, tie your son, count to three. 
But you on here want to be an Instagram rich ass hoe. Y'all hoes be always want to be relevant on here. Man. Don't got custody of your kid. Kids can't count to three. Kids can't use the bathroom. No. Not the bathroom. Fuck you mean, hoe? Ask Jit how old he is. He say bacon. <laughs> Fuck, nigga, get out my face. <laughs> and then you want to rhyme, rhyme, rhyme here and get... Oh, shit. I like bacon. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> That little boy ain't gonna make it. That little boy ain't gonna make it, goddamn it. Nope. Man, wait. How old you is? Nigga, tacos, nigga. Where the fuck you live at? Airplane, bitch. He's an ass jet how old he is. He say bacon. <laughs> that man was mad. Hey, he was upset. <laughs> I ain't get that mad. He was upset. Somebody should got that bitch on live because he, he need to talk to her. Oh, man. And you need to do something with your son, bitch. <laughs> You do. That ain't right. That ain't right at he all. You don't got to count to 20 or 30 at two. He don't got to. But he, but he can't know say his, bacon. Yeah, he can't. He should know. <laughs> he should know he not baking years old, God damn it. He should know that shit. He should know that shit. <laughs> he is not baking years old. <laughs> Oh, it's fucked up because it's true. It's really some kids man, out wait, here. That's just really fucked up. Where you live at, Hamburger? Man, everybody ain't meant to be a parent. Or at least everybody yeah. don't do it at the right time. Everybody ain't life. meant to be a kid because if he said bacon, like that little boy slow guy. <laughs> she can't do a whole lot about that. Because <laughs> he know the word bacon. He said, I see no. <laughs> I don't think she can help that. He go, yeah. He gonna think he baking years old forever. Oh, God damn God. it. He <laughs> gonna be forty three. God bacon. damn it, man. What? I owe you with bacon. <laughs> he don't say nothing else. All he say is bacon. God damn it. He don't never say nothing else. But he's smart. He knows how to. <laughs> he don't even like bacon. He don't even like it. He don't even like it. He put the puzzle together really fast. Real fast, God damn it. And when he finished, he put the last piece in bacon. <laughs> <laughs> but, it, hey, Ruby's cool. He'll, he'll fix the fuck out of Ruby's crew, oh, God damn it. Shit. All right. Leave that little boy alone, man. You wild as hell for that. You wild as hell for that. <laughs> That's fucked up. Oh, shit. Do something with your oh. kids, man. Please do, please. If you know your little boy bacon years old, don't let yeah. people talk to him. You got to, yeah, you got to sit down. You got to stop. What you do? Get off your phone or get on your phone and show him something that's not bacon. Okay. Show him, show him some letters Sesame and numbers. Sesame Street account. All them goddamn. <laughs> what? <laughs> the fucking count? Shit. All right. Count all them motherfucking numbers. Damn. Let him see that shit. Quit showing the bacon. Mad. Man, what? Man, ask you how old he is. <laughs> it's all you see, goddamn it. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, do better with your cheer. Oh, the internet. I can't say shit. These last couple of days, I've been posting anything I seen. No. Man. Fuck it. Yeah, it's been fun, too. Probably Ain't take another money. hiatus soon. Fuck the internet. But, man. Yeah, but we love the internet, because that's how you see the smoke for me, the podcast, bitch. Your V of me. Um, are we. Is it. Is it? Is it about that time? I ain't even with my watch. It's all right, it, I told you. Oh, you did, didn't you? Tell them what time it is. What time is it? It's time, ladies and gentlemen, for a segment of the show that we call Reddit on Reddit. And the reason that we refer to it as Reddit on Reddit is because we read from Reddit. And then we relay those things to it. And then we help the person who originally wrote the thing on Reddit because we, the smokers, it's us too. Some are the best advice givers to ever, ever give advice in the history of advice giving. In the history. Like before the Anunnaki and the Emerald Tablets, we were already created in the stars as the best advice givers. Okay. And one day we manifested into the creations of wonderfully splendid human beings you see before you right now. And go. now we are here to do the job that we were so long ago created to do. Imagine how many people throughout time did not get the benefit. Yeah. Or what the fuck you get the benefit of right now? So many people. Einstein could have been so much fucking better. He could have been so much better. If we would have been like, yeah, nigga, no, like yeah. Van Gogh, like don't Probably cut your ear off, don't. bro. 
Yeah. Yeah, like, it's a couple people we could have saved I'm with the saying. advice that we provide. And a nigga could have right. told Martin Luther King, like, look, bro, you Balcony. doing your fucking thing out here. Yeah. But this one right here, yeah. don't fuck with it. Don't fuck with this one. Let's Somebody. just go get some bitches and some ice cream and we'll got them spin the block <laughs> and, and fuck with the next one. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> bitches and ice cream. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck with the next hey. one. I'm just saying. Yep. <coughs> you get the benefit of this shit, though. You go get some bitches at ice cream. <laughs> you going first? <laughs> I, I go first. Shit. <laughs> so, Reddit on Reddit number one. Number one. <laughs> so, I went and got some bitches and ice cream the other day. <laughs> no, that ain't, that ain't what to say. That ain't what to say. Um,. <laughs> Is this the one I picked? Fuck it. Thoughts on dating while living together, but separated. Mm. <laughs> oh, Watch so out, bitch. thoughts on some stupid shit? Yeah. <laughs> hey, like, yeah that, that. I feel like we didn't even got to read what he was talking about. Oh, well, Maybe they got the upside down pineapples. Maybe they got the upside down pineapples. Guy, they gotta have the upside <laughs> down <laughs> pineapples. Hey. They separate. Might be a party over there. You, you know, know somebody in this situation. If you separated, somebody gonna push the limits of like what the fuck we could do. A motherfucker breaking somebody home. No, you think so? I mean, unless they stand mature enough to sit down and set some boundaries when they first decide to do this shit. Does it matter if the other person's home when they bring them? I mean, I guess mm-hmm. it matter more, <laughs> but it still don't matter. Like, God damn it. Oh, it still don't matter? Damn. Now, if any situation I could imagine doing some dumb shit like this, yeah, you can't bring no nigga in my house, God damn it. In all, period. Never, God damn it. <laughs> it what is shit. y'all's house? Yeah, even our house. Yeah, no, you can't bring no nigga in this motherfucker. Okay. Oh, man, you come in here. It's a, a nigga been on the Pro Tools. He got a new verse man. on your computer. Shit that moved around. <laughs> What you mean, a nigga? He, he saved, used my last he, shell. He saved you? it on your shit. Man, all right, I, I ain't no more shells. Nigga drunk your last two beers. Now nah, we said it was cool if goddamn. Man. All right. Where the nigga live? Right. <laughs> yeah, no, nah, but fuck that. It's dumb anyway. You break up with a motherfucker, you leave. God yeah. damn it. Yeah. Let's see. My wife and I are living together but separated due to neither one of us being able to afford moving out. We have two kids and a co-parenting. On top of the normal pain of divorce, I'm longing for some connection with someone who may actually appreciate me. I'm actually, well, no, I initially thought that the right thing, right thing to do, the right thing, the to, right do thing to do, would be to wait until we are completely divorced to date anybody again. But it gets harder every day to push these feelings down. Has anyone felt like this, and what do you do to overcome it? I'm sorry, um, Reddit on Reddit viewers and listeners. I put I picked the bullshit Reddit on Reddit. I did that. <coughs> I accept responsibility for that because all this shit he said didn't matter like at all or none of that. Fuck trying to date somebody while you there and all this shit. Like you can afford. A bullshit apartment, maybe, or maybe a hotel. Anything is better. Like, get your roommate, goddamn it. You can't break up with a bitch with your wife divorced. You can't just stay there no more. It sounds like he just need to get some pussy. Like he just I mean, he, he do quick. he do need to get some pussy. And I think you can buy that. There's you can buy it. You can just go but online. He can't even afford phone. rent though. <laughs> <laughs> he can't afford different rent. They might be That's splitting like two thousand right now on the rent or something. I'm just saying. So he though. could get like some forty dollar pussy. Then he need to go get a, a, a goddamn nine hundred dollar apartment. You might not want to take the forty dollar pussy to your apartment anyway. Hey, the the nine hundred dollar apartment and the forty dollar pussy gonna be close anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, if this what you trying to do, there's an area you can do this shit in. I'm just right saying, right down the street, right around the corner, Man, okay. just right around the corner, forty dollars. I'm just saying. So if that's the route you trying to go, or you just oh, need yeah. some pussy shit, you can hey. get you a little spot right there where the I'm pussy be cheap at, guys. Good damn. advice. Shit. Good advice. I'm just saying. You're going to get your auto. You can get out of the situation you're in until your divorce is finalized. You can uh, 
quench the loneliness you've been feeling, she even though right. you don't really want another relationship. Nah, you don't want that bitch. Um, and you can still co-parent. You didn't sound like there were any problems with that. Yeah, nah, you ain't mentioned that shit at all. He said, we doing it. So, yeah, you good. You just horny, goddamn. I'm guiding them. Shit, all right. Go get that. Hey, that's the best advice you're going to get from anybody that's going to give you some advice, goddamn. For real. But um, dating... Why you living with a bitch? I don't see how that's gonna work anyway. I <laughs> very no. No, that's weird. I, I don't see that. Like you can't bring the bitch home. The bitch gonna call you. Like if you you out on a date and ain't no milk, the bitch gonna call you for you to bring some milk. Goddamn, and your date gonna want to know. Like oh yeah no, yeah no. My no wife no. When you when you home. at this point you not fucking with each other. Y'all don't talk about shit. You oh, don't they don't even to. fuck with each other. Look at this point she taking the trash out herself. I figured they they was like still cordial around nah, this bitch, God nah, damn it. No, they oh. not fucking with each other. I see that they ain't what I got. Out. I just okay, maybe so, maybe so. Cause they, they did say we only all. together because we can't afford to move out, yeah. God damn it. <laughs> like literally. I guess so. Maybe and they maybe obviously they can't afford the divorce yet either. Damn, but we ain't fucking damn. with each other. You stay over there. See, I'm I, I, stay over I here. had the idea we'll situation the in out. my head. Like nah, it's peachy in this motherfucker. I'm saying I'm telling you a nice one still. Man, okay. Shit. <laughs> I don't know. I'm, you know how these folks be acting behind closed doors. You're right, boy. though. You're right. I you feel like y'all crazy. sit down and come to a motherfucking understanding. This shit can, can be kind of smooth. You would think. You can you be kind of smooth. You like, look, think you we ain't got to hate each other in this motherfucker. This right. shit didn't work out. We here together. Like, let's be roommates, friends. Shit. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh-uh. No, no, no. Red, okay. No, whatever. We can be free. Red, okay. All right, yeah, that ain't gonna that ain't gonna work. That ain't gonna work at all. That ain't gonna work at all. And anything he do, she mad about. Yeah. You need to get know. on about it though. You know. Get on about it though. Yeah. And li- move to round the corner from the forty. Right. Don't and live you, on the same street with yeah. the forty. Yeah, like like two streets over, maybe. Cause you don't want the forty knocking on your door. Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> Cheap pussy knocking at well, your well, door. Well, you gotta go get the forty. If the forty <laughs> knock on your door, you fucked up. I That's what I was saying. You might not want the forty to come to where you at. I feel she like the forty the gotta there. know not to come back over here. Bitch, you the forty, goddamn. <laughs> Sometimes they be at the middle of the night. No. They, think, they might think you a new sucker. You new on the block. They gonna try you once or twice. Get you a dog too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take the dog. Man, what? Take the dog. I know y'all got a dog with your two kids. Train that bitch to bark at people. They not get the dog. <laughs> Train them to bark at the smell. Man, okay. <laughs> you smell that? That's the forty. That's the forty right there. You smell it? You get it. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, all right. <laughs> You're going to prison. <laughs> Man, and this dog keep attacking hookers. <laughs> Man, he bites him in the pussy every time. <laughs> like, what kind of dog is that? Good for it. Good for it. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. I'm oh, sorry. Man. That was bad advice. Oh, it was. That's domestic violence, and I think. Don't no, stop, stop domestic, domestic violence. <laughs> Stop it. This shit is for entertainment purposes. Don't do Solid. it. Please don't do it. Man, all right. Bill, you need to move out. Somebody needs to move out. It's, yeah. it's, it's fucked up. It's hard to do. Like, yeah, it's like you used to paying bills for two people, goddammit. But, I mean, it's it's doable, though, shit. At least you try, but shit. <laughs> I don't know. I, would, I wouldn't tell you to rush nowhere. I mean, nah, it but, ain't no rush, but, but this shit's not working. But hell. you can't just bring the 40 to y'all's house. Man, okay. See, that's what you're asking. No, 40, you can't this do is that. my wife. Wife, yeah. this is 40. <laughs> don't mind the smell. <laughs> <laughs> don't do that shit. Don't do that shit. <laughs> That ain't gonna work out well. Before they gonna get stabbed, <laughs> goddamn it. <laughs> Don't do that shit. Oh shit. Oh man. All right. Um how we just name the bitch the 40, <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we try to keep on his budget. I like it though. I like yeah, it. Yeah. That's dude. what you call these hoes now. <laughs> With a 40 says. 
I run so many for this so man, real. Man, I'm trying to see what the phone is at. Man, man. Okay. Ain't no phone. Where they be at? What club they man, be at? Okay. Shit. <laughs> He's gonna be mad to say it. No, oh, no, honey, so who you here. calling up for? Bitch, he done called us up for it. Oh, man. All right. Reddit on Reddit, number two. Number two. I ain't made like we ain't meant to do that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm saying. Um, the title is. My fiance's female best friend, the fiance's a man. My fiance's female best friend called him to the birthday party. Oh, I think invited him to a birthday party and I'm left out. How would you talk to him about it? Well, she mad that her fiance got a girl best friend. And she invited the fiance to a birthday party. Yeah. And she's not going. Right. She's left out. See, first off, I don't understand how, like, if you left out, that's your choice. Because if y'all a couple and somebody get an invitation somewhere, like, that mean we going. That don't mean it. you both invited. We, we fucking going. <laughs> that don't mean you invited. If she get an invitation somewhere that I want to go, <laughs> we is both fucking invited. Y'all could, y'all could both show up, but you ain't part of this festivities. You Absolutely. go sit at the bar or something. I'm sitting with this bitch. Nah. <laughs> nah. Nah. No. Absolutely. Absolutely, but <laughs> at the same time, that's probably not what this is. She's just jealous because she can't go and there's another girl going, goddamn. That's probably what this is. Yeah, it sounds it sound like she's just jealous of the, yeah, the, the girl, girl best, best friend. friend she, and she don't trust her fiancé. That's what it sounds like. Which, that's that's a problem. You might want to unfiancé that fiancé if that's how you feel Man, about I your fiancé. That's all I'm going to say. Um, hi, my fiancé and I have been together for 10 years and got engaged this year. I know his friend for ten I've known his friend for ten years and this is not the first time this happened. It bothered me before also, but somehow I didn't pay attention since we were in a relationship and not engaged. So I always just thought that maybe it's not a big deal. I must also say that she knows that we're engaged and when we told her she acted like, Okay, you got a ring, what else changed? No. Which also hit me a bit. Bitch, it's been ten years though, bitch. I tried to talk to my fiance. But he always keeps saying that I'm exaggerating and that I'm making a big deal out of nothing. But I feel anxious anytime he tells me something like that. And he also says the friend goes uh, alone without anyone as like a date or anything at the birthday party. So they're going to be together. I guess I'm not sure if she's joking or not, but... uh, the last sentence says, I, I didn't say that they're all women except him, but it got a winky face with it. So I don't really know what she mean by that. You mean it's all bitches except him? Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I think so. And she the only one that can't go. He's having a bachelor party. Oh, she upset about that. He's uh, having a bachelor party. be around a whole bunch of bitches? It's, no, fiance, fiance. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! Oh shit! Yeah, no, she out about that. Yeah, she's upset. But I mean, like I said, I, but I'm a, I'm different. Like I understand, I'm not invited if I don't get the invitation. But I don't give a fuck about that goddamn. Mm. If you want to keep it like politically correct, then I mean, yeah. But you know, this been his best friend for ten years. I feel like that ain't. If you ain't been worried about this shit, that ain't really shit you well, got to worry about. She said it bothered her before. I don't it's think she's ever been comfortable with it. And probably, he just yeah. was always like, you tripping, don't worry about this shit. Probably and so. And he'll go get some head. <laughs> 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 Bitch tripping to get head. No, she don't like you. She don't like you. <laughs> Man, okay. No, nothing, nothing. It's too long. Why you ain't like me? <laughs> Man, okay. Oh, that's shit. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. <laughs> that's fucked up. So she wants to know how she should talk to him about it. What should she do, guys? I feel like it ain't, it's just me. What should she do, guys? I don't, they could say in the comments what they think she should oh, do. Oh, okay. Um, I feel like, I don't, it's kind of, it, you should have had this talk with this motherfucker. <laughs> 
Nine and a half years ago, maybe, goddamn it. <laughs> no, I'm just saying. If she jealous of the best friend now, she's been jealous of the best friend. She known the best yeah. friend for 10 years, as long as she done known him. Which yeah. means they've been best friends for longer than he done known her, goddamn it. At least. At, at least. Let you eat me both of them at the same time. I'm going to like this one. I'm going to be he... friends with this oh. one. <laughs> He said, man, two bitches like this. Nah, I'm going to marry this one. I'm going to just be fucking this one. Yeah. Marry, fuck, kill. <laughs> he got a body, too? Yeah. <laughs> we ain't even know. Right, okay. <laughs> we ain't even know. Oh, uh, shit. Stay away from him. Nigga, good at what he do. <laughs> stay away man. from him. But yeah, um, like, I forgot. I f- dude got a body. Guy. <laughs> I forgot <laughs> we were talking about that <laughs> shit. <laughs> But yeah, now nah, um, I would just go if it was me for real. You can't do that. Yeah, you no, know, you can. Nah, then you fucking up. And it's a party their relationship. for real. Like if that's not what's supposed to be happening. If so, you Why just would... you just go, and then the person who invited your other half says, "Well, no, nah, no, nah. like I appreciate you showing up. You can say like happy birthday or whatever, but we only got space for." The person we invited. And I can't stay here? Nah, you know how when you go to skating ring, they got, you pay for six people, not seven. Yeah. Um, I, I motherfucker, if I get there and motherfucker tell me leave, I guess I'm going to leave because I ain't going to slap shit out of motherfucker because <laughs> they're the function <laughs> guy. <laughs> Sound like you're not. Like, yeah, now nah, your husband can't, you, like, matter of fact, you don't work at no more. <laughs> your husband just slapped the CEO. <laughs> right. <laughs> Slap the shit out of him too. Okay. <laughs> Why? What happened? He told him he couldn't come Man, in okay. the rope. We didn't open the rope. Bitch, what the fuck you mean? <laughs> My old lady, I'm coming in here, bitch. Why so many niggas in there? <laughs> you said you work with so many niggas? Right. Where all the other women at? I, I thought it was a bunch of bitches. <laughs> yeah, no. But no, yeah, if I can, mother tell me to leave, I'm going to leave. And I'm going to expect my bitch to be like, well, if he can't stay, then I'm going to have to go too, God damn it. I'm not going to say and that to she him. She does it. She, she says, nah, I, you know I was coming to this party. It's my friend party. I can't do it. I don't know why you're you right. That's, you right. I'm going to fuck with y'all later. Yeah, I'm going to fuck with y'all later. <laughs> yeah. All right. This you know shit, what that means. Yeah, that means this bitch shit going to be on the porch when she get back from where her friends. <laughs> I tell your little friends to pick up the minivan when they come bring you home. Because y'all gonna need some room. Man. <laughs> yeah. Um, t- also, the way she typed, it sounds like this might be a foreigner. Okay. Somewhere. Right. Maybe we, English isn't the first language. And if that's the case, and English is dude's first language, he really getting over on her. And yeah. I feel kind of bad. Cause, Probably. Yeah. And if that's the case, she might need to stay with him. Like, no, it was 10 years. She already in, she here legally. Why man, she can't okay. talk right? <laughs> <laughs> no, she just can't, can't type right. right. Okay. Yeah, no, you you can't do nothing about it. You can talk to them all you want. Yeah, no, they, All you they, can do is ask if you can join. It ain't going to change because they've been friends. Like, And if you don't like it, you better unfiance him. That's what you're going to have to do for real. You're going to have to be comfortable with your man having a female best friend for the rest of your life probably. Yeah. That's doing shit without you. One that intimidates you. She probably bad. Yeah. <laughs> Fine as hell. She was the fuck. Man, not okay. the Mary. So you got to, I mean, <laughs> yeah. Got, Mary fuck kill. <laughs> but yeah, I couldn't, like, my old lady could have, especially if she knew the motherfucker long as she knew me. But I feel like, yeah, it'll be weird. Like, especially if I can't go somewhere I want to go with y'all, yeah, that's going to be. And it's all dudes there with that, her? Yeah, see, now, nah, hell no. Nah. <laughs> Hell no, nah, bitch. <coughs> no, nah, see, I can't just say, bitch, you can't go. <laughs> but why is you in this? Explain to me what kind of setting it would be that you in with a whole bunch of niggas and you the only bitch here. There's only one setting I could even imagine for the girl right here. Uh, 20 v. 1. Man, okay. <coughs> No, I don't think so. Uh, a porn category. That's what it sound like. <laughs> That's what it sound like. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> Man. Man. No, if, <coughs> if my old lady could go somewhere, I'm feeling like I could go, goddamn. We we a package, goddamn. Whoever don't like this shit, like, it's on them. 
Mm. I feel like everything's circumstantial. That, that too. In, in that general, too. I don't think that if you're not invited, you should be showing up somewhere. I don't care nothing about this shit. Yeah. That's what invitation. Im, invitation? Invitations were invented for. You're right. It was. But a nigga like me was invented to not give a fuck about nothing of that shit. But then you going to give a fuck because that shit going to be on the porch. So you gave a fuck. No, yeah, yeah. no. I ain't yeah, give a fuck. Yeah. Not yeah, no. Fuck. Yeah, yeah. No, what happened was I found out what kind of bitch I had. It wasn't, it wasn't this situation's fault that this happened. It was a flaw in your character that I didn't know was there that I just discovered. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, it ain't. I'm, I'm grateful for this situation. And this is it, that you can't be, you can't come somewhere you weren't invited, and this is a flaw in her character. Yeah, 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 because you was supposed to go with crazy. me. crazy. If I get kicked out of this bitch, you kicked out of this bitch. You didn't. I we was came invited. together, didn't we? We came together. No. Yeah. No. We was in the same car. One invitation. In the sa- in one car. One, one invitation. invitation per car. <laughs> you know, this is the uh, invitation for the red Buick. Over there. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's four of us. It's four. Well, <laughs> right. Where we drive in at? We... <laughs> okay. <laughs> Fuck that. Ooh. Yeah, but that's the other thing too is the person that is giving out the invitations obviously don't have respect for none of them do the best the friend or the person who invited everybody to the party they no, don't the, get the, the, the best friend is the best friend the one that invited everybody okay that's the same person yeah, okay her party. yeah yeah they don't respect you at all God yeah. damn it. so that's the other thing too in that whole circumstantial part of because even though you got to talk about what you and your partner would do or how you handle that situation if the person that was inviting one of y'all had respect. They say they, they or know, to like, see you hey, an invitation for yeah, real. for both of y'all. Yeah. And since they didn't, then you know it's up. For real, for real. Because you've known her for 10 years. Yeah. So you can go in there swinging. You Especially can fuck her up. Later, you know, or you could join the threesome you know, if they, they want to do that. for 10 years and she still ain't like Yeah. Bitch, y'all supposed to, <laughs> y'all supposed to be friends too with this motherfucker. Yeah, that was no, it. You better no, go join. No, ain't got to be friends. But still, y'all got to fucking know each other at least for real. Best friend. I feel like best friend be around a motherfucker a lot, God damn it. Hey, your bitch ain't never around when, when she now. She ain't invited. No. She can't come. Mm-mm. Fuck that. Pull up on their ass. Yeah, nah, that yeah. ain't a situation I can find myself Yeah, you got to get out of that. Because yeah. you're going to either have to fight the best friend or you're going to have to join her and your fiance in a threesome. Get up out of there. And I don't think you want to do either one it of them. It don't sound like, No. So you're going to have to just leave. Get up out of there. It's over with. I'm um, fiance. You, hey, you almost made a mistake. Yeah. It was close. Yeah. It's been 10 years now. I'm just yeah. saying. Yeah. Ain't shit cool. changed in 10 years? They it's, still I, on that bullshit? I wasted 10 years of my life, too. Don't Man, worry. All right. It happens sometimes. You be like, damn, It happens sometimes. Years. It could have been worse. You could have went to jail for prison for 10 years. Yeah. That's wasting you. That's, well, now nah, I don't know. Some niggas come out of prison house more sometimes. No, you still wasted a whole bunch of time. You can be out here with uh, plastic semen. That's fucked up. Yeah. I don't know nothing about that. That's what the internet says. I don't you can't make no more babies. They're going to be plastic babies. They're going to be fucked up, too. Anyway. That's, that's why that little boy think he's um, making years old. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's it's, exactly what's the, the fuck plastic. going on. It's the plastic. That little boy got plastic all in their brain. Mm-hmm. Like a turtle got <laughs> Wait, what turtle? Like you know the turtle? turtle? No, the turtles, the sea turtles, be in oh, the straws they be and dying shit. from the. Oh, okay, yeah. Oh, that was dark. Hey, I, I don't know. It was <laughs> it put together. See, you fucked it up. It was uh-huh. funny till you hey. made it. Hey. No, I like it. I like it. The dark here with it. Do Um, yeah, lady. I'm fiance him. I ain't a man. Kato, for real. That's the best any, advice. Any words that you want to leave the people with? Um, let me see. You got anything you need to get off your chest? Let me see what I need to tell the people before we get up do. out this bitch. Um, America is a scam. Hey, Amen. Um, free everybody who in jail on some bullshit. Hey, Amen. We decide what the bullshit is. Um, yeah, I think that's all I got to say to the people. Look, we appreciate y'all fucking with us yeah, on yeah. another motherfucking edition oh, of the Smoking Permitted Podcast. Yeah. You know what I'm talking about? I 
it is your boy Kato Jackson. It is your boy Bob Jacquez. We is the smokers, and we is at this bitch. No, I'm talking about smoke some bitch. I ain't doing shit. Hey, look. This is for entertainment purposes only. Explicit motherfucking content. Parental guidance is strongly suggested. Pay attention to what your kid's doing on the internet. Subscribe, like, share. Smoke for me, the podcast. Let's get into the show. <laughs>